golden age unboxing ready to be performed for your viewing pleasure and for your cat viewing pleasure. But before I do that, stay tuned to what I'm going to do next. This video is sponsored by PGX Grading Services. Get one free pressing of your choice when you grade 10 with the code We Love Comics Free Press. Link in description. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Chris, and this is my channel, We Love Comics. And today I'm going to do an unboxing of a interesting Golden Age book. I'm sure not many people have shown this book before, so I'm excited to show you. But before I do that, there's something else I want to do. And this is regards to the video I made the other day, and by the way, I hope everybody had a happy and safe 4th of July. Um, hopefully everybody is uh, still in one piece and didn't get too crazy with fireworks. But this is the book I took out of the slab, and just to show you, it's still out of the slab. Of course, there's always going to be the negative Nancys, I like to call them. It's so easy to, to trigger some people these days, unfortunately, but I'm going to show you that because some claim though I can just put it back in the holder so let me disprove that right now just to give the the haters one less reason to send their hate but they're gonna do it anyway so I'm just doing this because I find it fun it will help trigger them and I like at this point I like doing that I like making those people very angry so now as you can see the cat I took that away, so now they cannot make another accusation about me. So that's that. So let's get back to the unboxing. So let's put this aside. So that is no longer an issue, because like I said, my integrity is more important than selling a comic and make extra bucks, because I am a firm believer that karma finds you. So you might as well do the right thing. Better to have good karma your way than bad karma. And I know some people say, oh, you don't have to do it, you're feeding the trolls, all this other stuff. As you could see with my channel, they follow me regardless, they've been doing it for years, so I might as well have fun at their expense, because like I said, they're so easily triggered, it's, it's not even a challenge at this point. So I do it for my own amusement. You know, not everybody's gonna do the same thing, and that's perfectly okay, that's the beautiful thing about my channel, is I do a lot of things weird and different. But I think some people appreciate that. So, Let's continue with this unboxing. This is something I never thought I would own, but I was very happy to get it, especially for the price I ended up winning it for, because those of you who watch my channel all the time know I love getting me some deals. So let's get this open. If anybody wants to make any guesses of what it would be, you're more than welcome to pause the video or just post it in the comment section while you're watching me do the actual unboxing and no it's not action comics number one or batman number one uh i wish it was but not as of yet have i been able to acquire that book but i am still happy with this nonetheless so let's put this here okay so they left this open that's a little weird so let's see who made their guesses or whatever and let's show the book, and then, of course, I always mention the price. So I have acquired... This is Archie's Pal Jughead, issue number one. And this does have a first appearance. Uh, this is the first appearance of the character known as Moose. He is the, the jock character in the Archie comics. So this is a book... From 1949, 10 cent, I love that. There's something about the 10 cent and 12 cent books that just brings back some nostalgia. Um, staples, as far as they said, are intact, but look at the colors. For a book this old, I mean, you could see there's some, there's a little bit of a tear right here. There are some creases. There's a little bit of a split right here. But I mean, look at the colors. That looks beautiful. And to me, especially with the older books, I don't mind the date stamp at all. I think that looks really nice. I would say this is probably a 2.5 to a 3.0. This is one of the books I will eventually get graded, but uh, this is such a great book. 
I mean, I was never really a major Archie fan, but to get a number one issue, you know, I couldn't pass up on it. So let me know what you would do. But here's the best part. Uh, this is about a five or $600 book in the grade that I have it. And of course, you guys know me, I'm not going to pay that. I paid a total with shipping and handling $302.00 for a Jughead issue number one, Archie's Pal Jughead, in, a, I would say, a pretty decent condition. Now, obviously, I have to take it out and look it up. So um, that's it. I absolutely love this book. Let me know if it's a book that you would acquire. What do you think of the price? Um, if you have not taken advantage of collecting Golden Age books, I highly recommend it. There's plenty of affordable books that you can get out there, um, especially the ones that are not comic-related, like superhero-related, and uh, you can get some good steals. So let me know what you think. Leave your comments. Hit the like button. Hit subscribe. Just don't hit the person next to you unless it's somebody that spends their life thumbing down my videos. Then you can punch them in the face. Nah, please don't do that. We don't want to stoop to their level. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And don't forget, it's not you. It's not I. It's We Love Comics. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next video. And not for nothing, his head really does not look like a jug.